Can you say hi? Hi. Hey. <gasps> Where's purple? Stop playing with me! Hey y'all, it's me, it's Key, and I am back with another video. You already know the vibe, honey. But this time, have something a little different for you so I am currently babysitting um, and those of you who know you know that I do that like on the side or whatever um, so I am babysitting one of my one of my little babies right here and of course I'm not gonna show her face even though she may want to finish cleaning up um, she is a one-year-old and um, she is a very bright one-year-old I used to work with her so um, no ma'am finish cleaning up thank you um i've been watching her since she was a baby um she used to work well she used to work i used to take care of her at my old job and her parents just kind of kept me in contact kept contact with me with her um because i do such a good job ain't that right collins say key can you say key Say key. <laughs> look. Hey. Look. You forgot this right here. Look. Put it up. Get that right there. Look. Collins. Look. Get that. Go put it up. Go put it up. Put it in your toy bin. Clean up. Put it in there. Put it in there. Oh. Woo! Good job, Collins. All right, let's go to your room. Ah, let's go to your room. Come on. Awesome. Good job, Collins. See, she's so smart. Ah, not that door. Not that door. We're going to your room. You want to go to your room? Yeah. Sitting here, and we're babysitting. We're getting this little extra cash, and I'm just taking y'all along with me. <gasps> it's a book. You want me to read you a book? Let's read a book. Come. My first toys. No. It's toys. Do you know what this is? What is this? You know? Say bear. Huh? <laughs> shoes. Say bear. Huh? Okay, we're saying shoes. Okay, let's look at let's look at our ball. I mean, let's look at our book. What's this? Say it louder. Say ball. 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 Collins wants to get in the camera. But baby, you can't get in the camera, girl. I read your book. What else do you want from me? Go give me another one. Here. Here. Go get another one. Go get another book. So yeah, y'all. I'm just here. Me and her, we chilling. Um, her parents pretty much did everything. So there's nothing for me to do. Normally, I would uh, give her like a bath and feed her and all that stuff but say my mommy already did that so i don't have to do it yay Ooh, let me see what you got let me see your book cassie you want to show the people your book let's show the people your book Ooh, what you got what is that this is a very good sensory book Ooh, do you feel that Oh, wow. Look at that. Oh, can I feel? <gasps> wow. Thank you. What do you got? Oh, wow. Grumpy Bunny. Look at his. What? 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 What are you talking about? <sighs> Y'all, she is a trip, y'all. She, when I got here, she had like, she didn't know who I was. She didn't want to come to me. But now, she want to play and talk. <laughs> what? You ready to go to sleep already? Huh? Where you going? No. No. Are you done with your book? All done? 
Go put it up. Go put it up. She's so good. Like, if you're one, you should be able to do this. If I tell you to do something, you should be able to. You may not be able to talk, but you should be able to fully understand what I'm saying to you and do it. And I should. Uh oh. Are you okay? Uh oh. That's okay. Get up. You're going to push your cart? You got to turn it around. There you go. Turn it around. She's bringing me this card. Where's the dog? Nope. Good job. No. Where's the doggy? Nope. What's the dog say? Mm. Where's pink? Oh. Where's purple? Where's purple? As I'm sitting here waiting for, what, 9, 30, 10 o'clock? How are y'all doing? I wish I would go live so y'all could like... <sighs> talk to me but um ow ow that hurt ma'am that hurt yes these are my shoes yeah those are your i don't eat your shoes yuck i'm just sitting here i'm uh, making easy money honey and trying to be a content creator and show y'all what i do when i come and babysit but um yeah you got something to say to the people comments can you say hi? Hi. Good job, Collins. Can you say bye-bye? Bye-bye. Good job, Collins. I am giving up on social media because I just... When I say social media, I mean like Snapchat, Facebook, Instagram. I might uh, get rid of TikTok. I'm not really sure yet because I find TikTok to be very resourceful. Um... So, is that a word? Resourceful? If it's not, don't come for me. I've been making up my own words. I promise you I do. But anyway, um... What you want? Your boppy? You can get your boppy. Go get it. Um, I just, I'm not, I don't want to see people in their business. Like, like, I hope I'm making sense. Like, YouTube... You kind of see people in their business, but they put out what they want you to put out versus on other platforms like Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat. People kind of really put like everything out there and it's just like it's too much for me to like consume. And I don't want to be, especially if I know you, if I know you, it's like, bro, I know you ain't like that in real life. But on social media, you're doing this and you're doing that. So, um. Girl, she is saying about this boppy. Get your boppy. Here, let me, like I was saying, um, it's different, like, when I know you and you're pro you're portraying to be something that you're not on social media. I don't like that. So, I just, I just, I don't like that. And I get very aggravated with it. So, I made the decision to get off of Facebook, get off of Instagram, and get off of Snapchat because I'm tired of looking at people. I'm tired of people, like, just doing the most. So, but anyway, y'all, I thought I was going to have something to show y'all, but I really don't because her mom pretty much did everything. And, hun, she is really talking to this Bobby right now. But I'm going to let her talk, honey. Let her talk. She's about to go to bed at 7.30. Bobby. No, now, now you got one boppy out. Yeah, you got that one boppy out. I ain't getting the other one. Honey, she is a trip. Talking about some boppy. You too big for that boppy. You one year, you're you're one year old. You don't need no boppy. No, you don't need no boppy. No, ain't no boppy. <laughs> no boppy. Josh, she back. Uh, no. No, Boppy. Yeah, use that one. She is. What? But yeah, y'all. I'm about to go.
done. Look at my, I'm sweating. Y'all see that? It's there. It's definitely there. Um, who is this? Her name is Grow with Joe. I'm gonna turn the camera around. This is her. I did 30 minutes of it, and I'm gonna do another one tonight. Be the Lord's will. And this is do this low impact workout every day to seriously lose weight. Um, losing weight will be a a bonus for me even though I do need to lose weight however I'm just focused on my blood pressure right now and I know I look crazy I'm about to go wash my hair but um I'm mainly doing this for my blood pressure and I know I'm sorry y'all I'm looking real crusty I know if I stay consistent with doing something low like this the results will come so I'm just kind of focusing on low sodium juicing and just moving if the weight comes off it comes off yes mom Are you talking? i'm talking to the camera say hi vlog yeah hi vlog hi vlog 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 all right all right y'all in this juice i have watermelon beets Pineapple, apple, and lemon. And it is so good, guys. do my second workout of the day and I am doing growth Joe and it is the beginner gospel dance party workout at home okay and it is 21 minutes um even 21 minutes and I'll probably do like um maybe just like a t another 10 minute one to, to equal like 30 minutes even though that'll be like you know 31 but anyway I don't know if y'all can see that but I'm doing pretty good um I did pretty good this morning. So right now I'm just trying to do at least two workouts a day and 30 minute each, 30 minutes each. So that's an hour of working out a day. So y'all let's, let's get to it. Glow, grow with Joe, okay? Grow with Joe. So much y'all so i stopped at exactly 40 minutes and 38 seconds uh, so i actually went over my time but that's okay that's what my watch is looking like now i got oh snap hold on we'll go okay i'm at 8,479 steps i'm sweaty as you can see i wish you could see the other parts of my my body but we're not gonna show that but this is how the forehead is looking the underarms are sweating my whole body is sweating um and i'm about to go get in the shower because honey i'm i feel yucky but today day two i worked out yesterday i did two workouts yesterday night so this is day two of the little exercise with glow is it glow grow with joe so, this is her stuff right here. And yeah, I did the gospel dance party workout. And it was a total of 22 minutes right there. All right, y'all. I'm out. Hi, right, good morning, y'all. It is currently 1058. And I am getting ready to do my workout for today. Um, this is day three of trying to do something with my life honey so um 
I was telling you all that I was doing the Grow with Joe uh, workout. Before we go home. And um, I've been loving them so far. Uh, I actually have... I actually have some workouts in my thing, but I think I want to just do an hour one. I was going to do two 30-minute workouts, one this morning for 30 minutes, and then uh, one this evening for 30 minutes. But because I have church, I think I'm going to do um, just one full hour right now, or at least 45 minutes. And I may do like a... um. I may do a uh like a 10 or 15 minute one uh tonight so i don't know where i got this 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 mindset to kind of just be active but i know i've been struggling with like my blood pressure and stuff so that may be one of the reasons why uh, i just want to be able to get up and move um and then I also feel like I have arthritis in my knees, but I've never been, like, diagnosed. I kind of, like, self-diagnosed myself with that. But, um, yeah. I don't know where this big, this big, uh, ball of energy came to move, but I'm doing it. I've been three days strong, and that's progress for me. My body is sore. I mean, sore, sore. And literally, I have not been doing anything. Like, her workouts are so low impact. Like, you're barely doing anything. It's nothing hardcore. It's just consistently moving. But it's little, but it's effective. And that's what I like. So, I be in here sweating. And I turn the fan off and everything as well. And today I'm wearing long sleeves because I wanted to sweat a little bit more. So, I think today I want to do an hour one, like I said. And I'm going to try to find an hour workout she has all kinds of stuff she has hit workouts back workouts butt workouts stretch workouts workouts um specifically for you trying to get steps she has ab workouts dancing workouts morning workouts afternoon workout sweaty workouts just walking workouts like she has a guy she has a gospel one which i did yesterday and y'all i had so much fun like i had so much fun so y'all it honey get into it i think i'm gonna just do this walk the weight off morning cardio abs it's 44 minutes and some change so i guess i'm gonna do this one it's not an hour but claire and i are you ready because i'm ready Excuse me. There you go, y'all. 11.47, I finished. All right, guys. So this is day three. 
Don't mind my water bottle in the back. But this is day three of Grow with Joe. I don't know why I want to say Glow with Joe, but it's Grow with Joe. Um, You can't really see that I'm sweating, but it's up there, y'all. I'm sweating. I am sweating. I'm just not sweating in visible places. Like, all of this is like, I don't know if y'all can see that. <laughs> But it's like soaking wet in my in my in my sports bra. Like and you know what the crazy thing is? I can tell a it's only been two days, well three days now, but I can tell a difference in this sports bra. Because normally I'll have like you know how you can just have like leakage, like <laughs> leakage. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna call it. You just have that overage pouch right there. Um I normally had that with this sports bra, but it's not that bad, like, right now. Or I'll have, like, some peeping out right here. I don't have that. So, that is, that's cool. Ugh, I got it all on my neck. Yuck. Look at that. Do y'all see that now? I really want y'all to see the sweat because hmm, you can't see it. But anyway, I'm sweating, y'all. Um, Day three, we knocked it out. Get up. If I can motivate myself to have some self-discipline, so can you. Get up and let's do it. I'm recording off my phone as well, y'all, because my back, my uh, my camera died. See, that's why I want to get a DSLR, uh, because this is the camera that I have. This is a vlogging camera. I mean, you could use it for other stuff too, but I want to. I'm Lord's will. I will be getting a Canon M50 uh, Mark II. I think that's what it is. I'll probably be getting that um when it go on sale honey mm. and if you'd want to know what this is it is beets uh watermelon lemon pineapple and apple mm. y'all it's so good mm 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 I made it because I've heard that beets are good for the heart. Watermelon is good for the heart. I've heard pineapple is good for the heart. Um, yeah, I heard all of it is good to like help reduce blood pressure. I can say that since I've been juicing, my blood pressure has been kind of like, I've been maintaining it. I still haven't gotten it back down to the normal blood pressure like my blood pressure readings have been like 135 over like 89 or something like that or like in the 80s um but before that my blood pressure was getting up to like 160 170 i think i've even had like a 180 range and that's that's the blood pressure i had um that i was reading when i was pregnant like 180 something mm. so I can say that I believe in, of course, me trying to watch what I eat as far as, like, sodium intake and stuff. Um, I have uh, been maintaining my blood pressure, which is good. I just, I'm trying to get it back down to the normal, to the normal reading, which is in the 120s. Um, if y'all have any tips or if y'all, you know, did... If y'all had high blood pressure or if you have high blood pressure and you have gotten it back down, give me some tips. And no, I do not want to take medication. Um, I was on blood pressure pills uh, after I had the baby. And I recently went on them maybe like two months ago before um, before summer started. I was on blood pressure medication because I had went to the hospital and I was doing it and I used the entire bottle and my dad, it kind of, it kind of goes into his family on his side. Like they have a lot of high blood pressure. Um, and I know I'm kind of just rambling right now, but anyway, um, on his side of the family, they, they have high blood pressure and he's just telling me, Oh, just take the medication. That's what I do. And I'm just like, no, because medication is only putting a band-aid on it it's not fixing the problem yes it, it'll lower your blood pressure but it's not lowering your blood pressure forever i need something that's going to permanently lower my blood pressure and if that means i have to change how i eat uh being physical all the time uh i mean not physical well yeah being fit well active i'm gonna say active being active all the time then i just gotta do what i have to do because 
I do desire to have a child one day. Both Jarell and I, we both desire to have a child. We'll try again for another child. But I don't want to be in the same position that I'm in now. Like, I want to be able to carry the baby without having high blood pressure, without going into preeclampsia or eclampsia. I don't want to have to deal with those issues. So right now, it wouldn't be a good idea to try to have another baby, especially when my blood pressure is still not in a good zone. So if that means I have to change change myself in order for my child to be born then i gotta do what i gotta do but anyway y'all i appreciate y'all for i'm gonna cut the blog off now um i would have did the whole week um and maybe i'll add the last what's today wednesday so thursday friday and saturday i'll add in the next vlog lord's will but I'm going to go ahead on and end it off with this vlog because today is Wednesday and I'm trying to be consistent with posting on one day so that you all know when I'm posting. Thank you for the new followers that I got, the new subscribers. Thank you so much for joining the key community. Mm. I'm still trying to find my niche or niche, whatever, however you say the word. I'm still trying to find my thing. Uh, but right now I'm just doing things that I enjoy doing. And, um... Yeah, y'all. Oh, yeah. I forgot to tell y'all. Hold on. I read two books last week. One is called Grown by Tiffany D. Jackson. Y'all, this book is so good. But I will tell you some trigger warnings in here. And, well, content warnings, whatever. And they actually mention it in the front of the book uh, before you even, like, start reading it. Um, Hold on. All right. So, it says content warning. Mentions of sexual abuse, rape, assault, child abuse, kidnapping, and addiction to, I don't know what this word is, op, eoids, I don't know. Whatever that word is, child, I don't know. But anyway, this book was so good, y'all. I enjoyed this book. I read this book in one day. I was up, I read it at like six something in the evening. I didn't finish about two o'clock, one or two o'clock in the morning. I was going to finish this book. It was so good. I... I encourage every female, whoever desires to get in a relationship, especially if you're young, read this. Because it talks about how these men try to control you, take advantage of you, and you just missing all the red flags. This was good. Tiffany D. Jackson, you did your thing with this, honey. And then the other one was Monday's Not Coming. This book was okay. I, I can't say that it was bad, but I can't say that it was good either. It was just like, all right, like, let's hurry up and get to the good part. Let's get to the good part because, baby, I'm tired. I'm tired, but it was basically about uh, her best friend who was suffering with child abuse. Um, and she went missing. And Monday, I mean, and Claudia, which is the girl, I guess, right here. Claudia is trying to find her. And she's basically... Uh, She's basically going off because nobody else is trying to find her best friend, which I understand. But you got to read the whole book to figure out what was going on. Another book that I read, y'all, is uh, Party of Two by Jasmine Gibson. Y'all, Jasmine Gillery, I love this book. It was so cute, y'all. It's a romance novel. It's a romance novel. Let me get my book. Y'all, I'm going to show you the cover. It's a romance novel. It's about a black uh, lawyer. It's a romance novel. And it's about a black lawyer. Or was she a lawyer? I think she was a lawyer. A black lawyer and a white senator. Y'all, this book was so cute. Basically, you know, she had some history or oh, whatever. They met at a at a bar and uh, they met again at like some type of conference or something. And he didn't want to miss his, his chance to like talk to her again. So he wound up reaching out to her and everything. They wound up talking and basically the the publicity that she was getting she didn't like and then they kind of went into her background and stuff that she did and they didn't like that she was black all this other stuff like it was really good i enjoyed this book this is one that i recommend out of jasmine guillory's collection i also have by the book but i didn't read it yet the next book that i'm getting ready to read y'all is allegedly Woo! i'm sorry y'all i'm gonna say this and then i'm gonna go the next book i'm about to read this week is allegedly by tiffany d jackson and it's i've um i didn't read the back but i've seen it on tiktok it's something about a girl killing a nine-month-old baby 
And then something about her having a baby or something, honey. But I'm going to let y'all know. I'm going to do a review on this book. But I've heard some good things about this book, y'all. I heard that it was really, really, really good. So I'm hoping that it does not disappoint. But anyway, thank y'all for watching. Thank y'all for hearing me ramble. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe for more. If you want me to keep up, if you want me to keep doing the uh, the workout videos with Grow With Joe, just let me know and I will try to record every time I do her workouts for the week. I am just trying to lower my blood pressure, like I said, but if we got a community, y'all, we can all rock out to Grow With Joe. Make sure you check out her YouTube channel, honey, because I love her. I love her and I've only been doing her videos for three days. Um, but yeah, y'all. Bye.